Hey, what's going on guys? It's Two Shot from Two Shot Gaming, and today's mod video is going to be the Myths and Monsters. It's a really cool mod for a full review on it, right at the top in the middle of the screen. PK King will do a full review as soon as the link's up there, as soon as he's done with the video. So check that out if you want to know more about the mod. I'll take it through step by step. Very easy, very simple. He does a great job on it. Um, on the top left hand corner they'll show you how to back your minecraft up just back your minecraft up nice and simple so you make sure any other mods or any steps that you might have done wrong are not in there you start from refresh minecraft because coding can always mess everything up you can try to install it with the mods you have now but make sure you back it up anyway just save it just copy your dot minecraft and paste it on your desktop or something like that so you can try to put this in there See if it works. If it works, fine, then just keep going. But as long as you have a backup, so you can put it back to where it was. On the right-hand side, there's a playlist. All the mods on that playlist, if they're updated, the titles will change to the new version that we're looking at. The new version that we're looking at, if it's there, it'll work. If it's not the version that Minecraft currently is, that means the mod hasn't updated yet. So don't try to install it, because it's just going to give you a blast screen. Okay, first thing we're going to do is we're going to look at the... As the page real quick. This is the mod maker's page right here. You just scroll down here, down to download links right here. This is Forge. You don't need Forge too. You can download it right from him. It'll probably be the easiest download for it because that's the one he most likely worked on to make this one. So use that download. So link here. They have the old ones for mod loader, but then he switched to Forge. So use this one right here. You do media flyer, media flyer or air fly. Just click on them. It'll take you to the links. Just in the middle of the page, it'll say download. Just download it. Nice and simple. Just And just drag them both to your desktop. We got the, the forge right here. And we got the myths and monsters right here. It's a very simple installation. We'll take you through step by step. First thing you come down here. Hit your start key. Do percent app data percent go to your roman file click on your roman file that'll bring you to your dot minecraft double click your dot minecraft to take you to ben resources saves textures all that stuff click double click on your ben then you'll have a minecraft here it can see minecraft.jar if you have your file extensions open if you don't have your file extensions open it'll just say minecraft that's all right click on that highlight it right click Open with 7-Zip or WinRAR, whatever you want to use, any archive you need. If you don't have an archiver, look on Google and download them. Do Open Archiver. That'll bring up your Minecraft. This is your Minecraft right here. I'm going to end folder right here. You want to get rid of this. You can't mod with it. Just delete. Right-click and delete it. It's gone. Okay, it's missing. Totally gone. Minecraft Forge. Let's bring this over. We'll do Minecraft Forge first. Right click, open with 7-zip, Minecraft Forge, drag over here, Minecraft Forge has a minute in file, sometimes people tell me they delete this, you can delete this too or whatever you want to do, um, what I usually do, I leave it in, I never had a problem with it, you can go all the way down to the bottom, drag everything, or you can do control A, highlight everything like that, just take it, drag it all in. Control A. People have been bothering me about doing it. So just hit Control A and you can highlight everything. Now you have another minute infold in here. This is Forges. I'm going to leave it in. Doesn't really matter to me. It's fine. Now we're done with Forge. Close these out. This is how I always do it. I'm not going to change how I do this. We still didn't put this in yet. What we're going to do now is go down to our Minecraft startup. You want to load Forge in first. Let Forge set up, nice and easy, take its time. You see the Mojang screen? You'll see Forge. Three mods out of three mods loaded. If you click here, this is the Forge, the Coda Pack, and the Forge Loader. You're good. Quit Minecraft. Make sure you always have Minecraft closed when you're modding. If not, it won't let you move the files around. Then you come back to your start menu, you do percent app data percent again. That'll take you to the Roman again, just like we did before. Double click your dot Minecraft. 
Then you're right in here, and now you have new folders here. Go to mods. That mod folder is empty. Take your myths and monsters mod, put it in here. Nice and simple, just close it. Start your Minecraft up again. Do like this. Make it nice and big so everybody can see it. Give it a few seconds. You got four mods out of four mods loaded now. You look, now the Myths and Monsters mod is in here. Hit done. Go to single play. Go to create world. You probably want to play it in survival, but we're going to, we're going to do a creative world so we can spawn the eggs to show you that monsters are in here. These monsters are in different biomes. It's a really cool mod. Check out the review on it. It's going to be nice for you guys. You're going to, you're going to appreciate it. It does a great job on it. All right, here's... Here's a little messed up one, so let's, let's spawn these things in. Oh, you have to, I think you have to be in the, like, I thought you had to be in a snow mine over here. Yeah, these things give you darkness. That's cool. Alright, let's check out, let's check out the other ones just so you can see them. These are a little more, there's, um, there's actually hunters in these that I think are not ready yet. Like, you got these little guys. They shoot sticks and stuff at you. Then you got these big guys. These big guys, just so you know, they decay. You saw that they decay the leaves on the trees. They make them turn into gravel. Just like a little troll thing. So, be careful with these guys. And they're very hard to kill. They're kind of, they're kind of what I see is like an iron golem. So, be careful with it. Don't spawn too many because they'll fuck up your world. But you'll find these all in different biomes. Alright guys, so thanks so much for watching. Any problems, leave them in the description. And until next time guys, leave them in the comments. All the links will be in the description. Until next time guys, peace.